In an interview with Iranian media, Brigadier General Kumars Haidari, the commander of the Iranian Army's ground forces, announced the upcoming debut of two advanced missiles developed by Iran and detailed new strategic deployments aimed at strengthening Iran's border security. Regarding missile development, Haidari confirmed that two newly developed missiles have completed their construction phases and are ready for imminent public introduction and mass production. Haidari also spoke about the strategic positioning of missile, drone, and artillery units along the country's borders, emphasizing their importance in maintaining national security and improving the preparedness of the forces. Presently, 11 mobile and assault units of the Iranian army's ground forces are deployed along the borders. The deployment of five drone platoons and five missile units to the borders is underway, he said, adding that the positioning of the units did not mean that the country was faced with a threat, but to maintain his forces' preparedness as well as intelligence dominance and domination over the country's borders. He also discussed Iran's military strategy, highlighting the successful drone exercise conducted in October and the planned ground force exercises set to take place throughout the year culminating in a major exercise before the end of the year. Addressing the recent terrorist attack in Kerman's southeastern city, Haidari condemned the attack, which resulted in the loss of 94 lives and left over 200 injured near the tomb of Lt. Gen. Qasem Soleimani on the fourth anniversary of his death. Over the past few years, Iran has significantly advanced its missile capabilities, focusing on the development of automated missile launch systems, precision-guided missiles with increased range, and solid propellant rocket stages. These advancements are central to Iran's strategic military goals of regional dominance and deterrence. Iran's missile program, which includes the Karamshar ballistic missile and other types, represents the largest missile force in the Middle East, capable of striking targets up to 2,000 kilometers away. The Iranian authorities continue to emphasize their commitment to strengthening the nation's military capabilities. Amid increased tensions in the Middle East, Tehran has issued warnings of potential retaliation against the United States and Israel in response to their military actions in Gaza. Concurrently, in Yemen, the military interventions by the United States and the United Kingdom targeting Houthi rebels, which followed assaults on commercial ships in the Red Sea, have elicited significant responses from Iran.